All right, we're out here at the pool and the water fountain's leaking. So I'm working on getting the screws out here. So let me finish getting these out and we'll see what's going on here. All right, we had to take the cover off that one too because uh, that's where our shutoff valve is, right back there, to get the water off. And I got a leak on this one too, right there. So both our uh, plastic valves are cracked and that would be from the cold weather we had. So I'm gonna have to shut the water off and then I'll unplug it as well. Okay, the water's off and I just went into GFCI here and hit the test button. That way it kills the power to it. So now it'll slowly start dripping. And I'll order two new valves. And when those come in, we'll do a video on it. Okay, our valves came in for our water fountains. So we'll go down and remove the old and we'll install our two new valves. Okay, I'm just gonna remove the screws that I put in. I believe I just put one on each side just to hold it up until we got our valves. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove those and we'll get started. Okay, we're gonna have a ground wire screw here, two screws here, and we got our wire harness right up there to unplug. So we'll go ahead and remove everything. Two wires and the power is off and now we got our two water lines here one coming from the side and this one here in the back this little ring just press that in and pull your line out I'm gonna get a little bit of water coming out Do the same with this one press the ring and pull the hose out so we're just going to cut this back a little bit so we have a fresh piece. There we go. Nice new cut. So we'll slide that in. And we'll do the same thing with this one. Slide this right back here. Make sure you get it in all the way. Now hook our wires up. Okay. Now we'll go ahead and set it up in place. And our ground wire will go right here. Get our two mounting screws. And this screw uh, slot right here, that will be our adjustment that we'll use to adjust the height of the water coming out of the spout. So now I'm just going to do the same thing with this one. I'm going to go ahead, remove everything, and get the new one set up.
Okay, we got them both hooked up. So now we'll go ahead and turn the water back on and check for leaks. Turn our power back on. Compressor's running. Everything looks dry up with this one. Same with that. I'm going to get my uh, screwdriver and show you how to adjust the height. Okay, we'll watch the water height change. If I turn it counterclockwise, you can see it going down. Turn it clockwise, it will increase it. Which we're going to leave it right about there. You don't want it too high, otherwise, it starts splashing. And that one looks pretty good, too. So I'm just going to leave them right where they are. All right, I just got to put the covers back on and these water fountains are good to go. All right, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.